Hello, special education services providers. Today, I'm going to teach you how to connect n to y curriculum with your Canvas. To do that, first you have to go to a browser and log into your Canvas. Type opcpsinstructor.com. After providing your credentials, OKCPS credentials to Canvas, you should be able to see your dashboard. After getting into your dashboard, you can either use your sandbox to practice in, and you should have your first last name sandbox course located in your unpublished courses in your dashboard. If you don't, don't fear, you can start a new course on your own. Go to your right hand side. I have a to-do list because I have a lot of courses at this time. If you don't have many courses, you might not have a to-do list. Your start a new course might be located top right. Click start a new course. Following that, create a course name. Your course name could be anything. I will choose this. I will not create a short name for my class and I will not change content license. I will create a course. After creating a course, you will see nothing because you have no content. I recommend to start a module. Modules work like units. I like to create week one module. Add module. Now I'm going to work building content within my week one. I would like to add Monday just as a text. Plus, add text header Monday, add item. Now I would like to add a link to N2Y. I will go back and click on the plus as well. Next, I will add assignment will create new assignment i would like to name it monday and to y add item next you will have to click on the assignment yes you created it but it's completely empty Click on Monday and to Y. Next, you will have to go to edit the pencil icon top right. Here we have a name of your assignment. Next, in the body of your assignment, you will type N to Y. Login. Now, to link N to Y curriculum login to your assignment, you will have to get a link from N to Y. Go to another tab in your browser, retrieve link for N to Y by copying it, go back to your canvas, next. Highlight the text, go to the icon in Rich Content Editor, which looks like a chain link. You will click on that and you will choose External Links. Next, you will click on the link and you will click Paste. Next, you click Done. Next, you can assign points for students. How many points are they going to get for clicking at this assignment? Because this is external tool, their assignment is graded in N2Y. Here, you're assigning points just to go into the assignment. You can leave it at zero or you can decide how many points you want to give. 
you will leave assignment group as assignments. Display grade as, you have a choice. I will leave points. You can click do not count this assignment towards the final grade. Submission type. I like to choose online because they will be working online. Website URL because they are going to the website you have linked in your body of text. Submission attempts. I will just choose limited for this option and choose one. Unless you want them to use this on Monday multiple times. After setting submission attempts, group assignments, we leave blank. Peer reviews, we leave blank. Sync to sys. If you decided to give points to students for clicking at this assignment, you want to click include this assignment grade when syncing to your school student information system, which for us is Infinite Compass. Next, assign. You can assign it to everyone within your course or just individual child. By clicking here, you will see a list of names. Because I currently don't have anybody in my course, you cannot see names of students. Due date, when this is specifically due. You can click and add specific day, Monday 24th or Monday 31st. Available from until. If this assignment is available weekly, you will be able to set that up here as well. As an example. Next, I will save. Now, I'm going to click back on modules. This is week one for Monday. So far, I have only N to Y for my students. For students to be able to see their assignments, you have to publish. To publish your assignments and modules, go to this cross circle sign. When you hover over, you see publish. Click. And now everything within week one has been published. Students will see their assignment. Now, let's check what happens when we click on our link. Let's go to the assignment by clicking on Monday and 2 i Next, we can click on n 2 y login. And as you see, it's taking us to the third party n 2 y website where students can go and sign in I hope that helps. Have a wonderful day.